those who've said I do are more likely to catch this serious medical condition early. I'm talking about melanoma. So yeah. it shows that married couples are more likely to help each other. So, Bill, do you take a, do you check yeah, your wives? Is, well, I mean, we're not like two baboons at the Bulls. zoo picking bugs. Up, you know? <laughs> Let me get that yeah, for you. Yeah. No, but but it is true because like uh, I had a prime example that there was a. Uh, I had on my ear, I had because I play a lot of golf, mm -hmm. and one night Gail said, what is that, how long has that been there? Mm -hmm. And I went, and it was a little mm -hmm. cancerous thing that mm -hmm. they took off. Mm -hmm. But I think it's because you, you, you do, because you're, you're in bed together, you see each other coming in and out of the shower and stuff, so you know, and you're there every day together, so you yeah. notice things. Yeah. And I think it's a good thing, and also, you have to put in the fact of every time I walk outside, did you put on sunscreen? No, oh, yeah. Totally. Even I mean, like yeah. dating girls, I've never been married, but I'll wear more sunscreen when I'm in a relationship because mm -hmm. I always get harped at. And they're there at the beach to like put it on your back versus having to go up to a stranger. You can do it, but it's, you know, it's, it's always a little bit awkward. <laughs> there are a couple of reasons. The first you just pointed out, which is that you have another set of eyes who see you on a regular basis and can look for changes in your skin, mm -hmm. which is really helpful when it comes to skin cancer, certainly. Well, but you also have social support. It helps to have someone say, yep. hey, I really encourage you to go yeah. get this checked out. Well, my wife's got it well covered. She married a plastic <laughs> surgeon. And anything she discovers, she goes, take a look at this. Is it OK? Am I going to be OK? Do you have to remove this? And but even if you're single, yeah, you, you shouldn't get scared. Skin cancer. So there's always a Certainly. dermatologist who can look at your skin, but some things you can remember. Remember A, B, C, D, E. So A, asymmetry. If the mole is asymmetric, it's not the same on both mm -hmm. sides. B, if the border is irregular. C, the color, if you're noticing different colors. Mm -hmm. D, the diameter. If it's six millimeters or more, then you want to make sure you get that checked out. Mm -hmm. And E, just if it's evolving, so changing in size, shape, or color, make sure it's evaluated. So, you know, it, there really was a big difference because those who were married, 46% uh, had stage one. Um, the chance of catching the disease dropped 32% for singles, 38% if divorced, and 70% if the individual was a widow. So there was like a big difference. Wow. Well, and it does That's make a difference. A quick, quick story. I was at a barbecue talking to my friend, looked down, he had shorts on, I saw something on his leg I didn't like, I knew. The ABCD, mm -hmm. I knew, it was mm -hmm. dark. Mm -hmm. My trained eye, I knew it was melanoma. I said, mm -hmm. no, I want you in the office Monday. Yeah. Biopsied it, yes, melanoma. Mm -hmm. Sent him into New York City to a melanoma specialist who mm -hmm. ended up doing a deeper section skin grafts. Discovering that thing at that mm -hmm. barbecue saved his life. So mm -hmm. keep an eye, yeah. keep an eye on your partners.